Buying a house is a very exciting experience, but also brings a lot of stress because you're embarking into something you're not familiar with, which is where I come in. I'm Gustavo from GustavoRamosRealtor.com with Best Homes Real Estate. I'm a realtor here in Phoenix, Arizona, and I help families buy and sell real estate. In this video, I want to go over five important questions you should ask yourself before buying a new construction home. The agent in the office works for the company, so it's fair to assume that they don't have your best interest at heart. Before you go to any new built home, make sure to go with an agent you trust, one with good reputation like myself, and go over the home buying process. This way you're more aware and at peace with making a decision. The biggest difference between a new construction home and a resale home is the time it takes to close on a house. A lender cannot close on a home until you're ready to move in that day. So you'll have to make sure your credit is stable and maintain good standings throughout the process. It's not really a concern, simply something to consider and be aware of. Also keep in mind that a lot of factors can slow down a builder and might even push back the closing of your home 30 days or more. In some contracts you sign, they have the ability to extend the contract up to two years without ramifications due to the unforeseeable delays that occur during construction. You can close on your home once a certification of occupancy has been issued, pretty much certifying that your home is in good standings with building and safety codes. Sometimes, if it's too good to be true, it might be. These incentives are attractive to many buyers since the builder is covering your closing costs. But just keep in mind, in many cases, there might be a cap to how much they're willing to credit you. So make sure to read the fine print. Have a trustworthy agent like myself to help you out. In other cases, you might actually save more money. I like to say everything is situational. Not everyone is in the same situation as you or have the same priorities or likings. So make sure to focus on what's the best deal for you and your family. The base price is simply the starting price of the model home available. The sample homes you most likely view are with the highest modifications, which would increase the value of the home. Not all builders operate the same. Some will build the home without any custom options and sell the home as is with the asking price, not a base price. For example, the base price of a newly built home here in Phoenix, Arizona can be $345,000. But once you've chosen the additions you want to make on your home, the final price might end up being $375,000. Throughout the process, they'll make sure to inform you of the cost when you're making these choices. I hope you found this video informative. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any more questions, please leave them in the comment section below. I will also be including links to my buyer's guide. This guide will help you understand basic terms as well as the process of buying your home. Seller's guide. If you're thinking about selling, this will help you go over the most important steps. I will also be including my link tree with my social media. Thank you again for your time. Please stay tuned for my next video.